Hi everyone, Bianca here from the Vitality Kitchen. Long time no see. Well, despite that, it's the new year. We're all thinking about cleanses, detoxes, resolutions, and the like. So I want to give you a recipe that I shared in my delicious detox cooking class that mimics Caesar salad without any of the crazy stuff. 100% vegan and full of just life promoting foods. So the first thing that we're going to have are soaked walnuts. The reason that we soak the walnuts is it's going to increase the digestibility of the nut. We're going to increase the vitamin capacity, the enzyme activity, and it's also just going to make it easier for, to blend in our blender. Especially if you don't have a really powerful blender like a Blendtec or a Vitamix, you're really going to want to soak your nuts at all times. And then we have garlic because it's not Caesar dressing unless there's some garlic in it. Now, warning, this is not something that you want to eat if you are going on a date later or if you have an important meeting, but I'll tell you what, it's so good you might not even care. And then we're going to add some Dijon mustard, stone ground, organic, whatever, it's up to you, but you want really good Dijon mustard, so French's is not going to cut it. And then we have some pinto beans. Now, I like to add beans because, again, we're upping the fiber, we're going to up the protein, and it's just going to make it really rich and creamy. These are BPA-free canned beans from Eden Organic. If you want to soak your beans overnight and then cook them and then use them, please be my guest. And then we have some pink Himalayan salt. I really like Himalayan salt. It's really flavorful, especially good in raw preparations because it's not being heated. It's not going to sort of dissolve into it. And then we have lemon juice mixed with apple cider vinegar. The reason that I mix both of them is because I like the kick that it gives it, that sort of tart flavor that you're used to in a Caesar dressing. But also, our liver loves this stuff. So my apple cider vinegar has the mother still in it, so that is the fermented nature that's going to be really good for our digestion. And then, of course, just freshly squeezed lemon juice. And then the nuts. And then we're going to turn it on. So what we have to do is we have to turn it on. And then we're going to pour the oil in slowly. And what this creates is called an emulsion. Otherwise, you're just going to have sort of the liquid and the oil separate. But we want them to become friends. So what we're going to do is we're going to pour it in slowly. And it'll start to emulsify. Oh, yeah. And you can smell it. And sometimes you might need a little bit of water just to loosen it up if you want more of a runny dressing. So I have a little bit of water. I'm just going to pour a tiny, tiny bit in there. And then I'm going to blend it just a little bit more. Boom. So what we're going to be making our Caesar salad with is kale and romaine. Now you can make it with just kale, but I like to make it with romaine as well because people like familiarity. We don't want to change it too much. And then... Clean hands, of course, always. Clean hands, you want to pour the dressing over. And then massage. Even with the romaine in there, I know we don't traditionally massage romaine, but I think in this salad it sort of just combines the kale and they both sort of break down so it's a really nice, easy eat. Just massage. If you have any pent up anger, feeling frustrated, this is the job for you. And then you get a delicious reward at the end of it. And then there you go. That's it. A super easy recipe for the new year for you of a vegan kale Caesar salad made with walnuts, made with beans, Dijon mustard, apple cider vinegar. I mean, in the words of Martha Stewart, it's all good. So I'm Bianca from the Vitality Kitchen. I want to thank you again for watching, and I hope to see more of you in the new year. Bye.